Hello, Prio.com. This is Jagannath Patnaik. Uh, I am the director of channel sales for uh, South Asia for Kaspersky Lab. And uh, as you guys know, Kaspersky Lab is the world's uh, top four uh, security software companies. We are the developers of security software and uh, other security products. And this is a Russian multinational company having offices in 29 countries and operations in more than 100 uh, countries worldwide. Our software products are sold and uh, we also give technology <coughs> uh, services to various uh, bigger players such as Tecpo and Juniper etc. And uh, the, I'll tell you a little bit about uh, Kaspersky. Kaspersky is a company which was started in Russia about uh, 16 years back in 1997 by Mr. Eugene Kaspersky and Natalia Kaspersky. They were working in a company called AB Pro, Antivirus Pro. They started with this. Eugene was very fascinated to f write, uh, find out viruses and write antivirus tools for that and suddenly they realized that they should uh, go into the market with the product. So that's how what started as a small uh, company with just two people. Today we grew up to more than 2700 plus employees worldwide and uh, uh, offices in 29 countries and uh, the product is available worldwide in more than 100 plus countries about 200 countries so uh, the product is available in more than 200 countries worldwide everywhere wherever you go you will see the Kaspersky product uh, we are uh, number one in uh, retail segment in um, US Europe and uh, most of the Middle East countries and in Russia we are number one in retail as well as enterprise and we are uh, in the world when you take out uh, when you look at uh, security software vendors we are very close to be on the top three security software vendors worldwide and when it comes to South Asia that's the reason which I represent we are uh, number one in fact we are number one by miles and miles in Bangladesh, Nepal and Sri Lanka especially in Bangladesh we are way ahead of anybody else and in India we are number one nearly in retail segment and uh, in enterprise segment we are moving ahead and let me talk about Bangladesh Kaspersky when we started our uh, initial uh, movement into the market about five years back we were just looking at this market okay this is a very highly pirated market but today i think kaspersky has shown the way for the bangladeshi people to go against piracy many a thanks to our local distributors here who are like kaspersky bangladesh that is office extracts mr prabir sarkar and his team they have done a wonderful job today i am very happy to see that at least in antivirus segment the piracy rates are low even though the piracy rates in other securities other softwares are pretty high but then people are slowly learning that the benefits of using licensed software i take pride and i am proud to say that kaspersky has taught people in south asia particularly in Bangladesh and uh, in South Asia in general like uh, India, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Bhutan, Myanmar, so Bhutan, uh, then Maldives to get used to the buying software. Basically, we looked at it in a different manner. Why people don't buy software? It's only because people think we are all very cost conscious people, especially in this region. And we looked at it. If I can give, if we can give the security software at the cost of a teacup a day, less than a teacup a day, that's how the people started taking this. And today we are doing pretty well in Bangladesh, and we have nearly about uh, 800,000 users. 800, nearly about a million users very close to very soon in Bangladesh alone 
and when it comes to other countries probably in india we have about 6 million users and then uh, we in bangladesh the we are there in almost all the banks and some of the banks uh, use our products on their uh, website use their products on their retail outlets along with the telecom products some of the <coughs> banks like gramin phone uh, the gramin phone is one big example just repeat it again okay we are uh, our products are used in most of the uh, corporates in bangladesh lead bit be telecom companies bit be banks bit be universities education institutes and the government offices we are very widely present almost very huge market share i don't want to pinpoint and say this is my market share but we are the by far very long leaders in this and also i am very proud to say that we are some of the telecom companies are using our products to pitch forth in their uh, retail outlets such as gramin phone as very pleased when i was coming out of dhaka international airport today i saw kaspersky products there when i looked at it it was a gramin phones outlet and that's the way we penetrated the market and the type of customers what we have if i have to name a few about 30 banks whole defense system police undp then uh, Mm, universities all major universities they use our product and by doing this what we are doing is that we are inculcating a culture of uh, going against piracy in the end minds like in the universities if you are going in that there, there we are uh, telling people the young students to go against piracy and use they they understand the benefits of using a genuine products so that's what our biggest usp or our biggest success in this part of region especially in bangladesh taking piracy by its horns what do you call taking the horn by bull taking the bull by horn that's how prabir sarkar and his team has done it <laughs> so initially we had very like i said in the beginning i said five years back when we started we just looked at this market as okay whatever comes is a bonus but today we look at bangladesh as one of our uh, major contributors especially for south asia and apac region and uh, i will be very happy to share with you that uh, our bangladesh operations under mr prabhu sarkar their office extract has been chosen as the distributor of the year for the apac region in uh, 2010 and uh, recently he has been chosen as the corporate distributor is we are very very proud of our bangladesh operations here we don't look at office extract as a separate thing or as just a distributor we look at, uh, at office extract as extension of kaspersky lab apac for us so that's the we are very serious about bangladesh and uh, we are uh, also looking at bangladesh taking a much more major role in terms of uh, technical support which they provide wonderful technical support they are providing probably for this reason my as my boss last time he came and he was looking at maybe we are counting bangladesh as one of the countries where we can set up our call center i cannot promise at the moment but we are looking at all the feasibilities and possibilities and uh, the kind of tech support or uh, the kind of uh, manpower what uh, office extra has got to support our products both in terms in retail as well as in terms of home users as well as enterprise customers is fantastic i hardly get an escalation from them for any kind of support so that's the way it moves and uh, looking at the antivirus market in such in general i want to uh advise people those who are watching this video that my dear friends today the internet penetration is going to get double and double every quarter as a result the kind of uh, threats what you are likely to get and today we are looking at about 125000 various kinds of malware which are coming 
and to get protected against this okay people can say that i have such and such os which has got its inbuilt uh, security software and other thing but i'll tell you you need to have a specialized security software it is like i have a fracture uh, and i go to a general physician that doesn't work if i have a fracture i better go to orthopedician same is the case where when it comes to security software is you know, one people have to use uh, genuine and uh, correct security software which and don't have that myth security software will uh, slow down your pc or will cause uh, unwanted hindrance to your work no the technology has improved so much that the security software what resides on your pc is a very small portion what controls your pc for the security of uh, the computer is through the cloud that is kaspersky security network from there the whole of the security is controlled so it is a very simple easy to use then as the technology is moving up as it is seen everywhere i think is the time that we adopt it in a big way and that's what is the dream of bangladesh government also i think is a digital bangladesh is what the coin is which is happening so we are happy to be part of that in some other other way which we are trying to do it and before i say anything i would like to thank all my uh, resellers dealers across bangladesh i have gone to small small town like cox bazar and other places it not only dhaka dhaka is major market but outside dhaka also there are plenty of small resellers that are doing good job i congratulate all the computer dealers of bangladesh for putting our product in this manner they by helping people to fight against piracy that's a good job done by my dealers and resellers in bangladesh in particular is concern i don't see much of competition coming from anywhere because we have very strong network of resellers dealers and our distributor they are very strongly bound to each other it's very difficult for anybody to break this bond it's like uh, in k those who are chemical engineers they know it's it's like a covalent bond there is one electron coming from here one electron coming here both are matching each other similarly the office extract and resellers they are bond so strongly that uh, it's very difficult and i don't we i'd like to see some competition but then in bangladesh i don't think there is much of scope for that well uh, we have competition in india we have competition in uh, other countries and competition is good for the growth but uh, we have i cite an example always of bangladesh to my bosses saying that look bangladesh we are almost moved much ahead of competition competition is not competition we say it as a complement so in bangladesh i don't see much of competition but there, there is a competition worldwide for us uh, from uh, the red box the yellow box and what over it is we call people may not know what is red and yellow in bangladesh because there is no competition i would like to tell about two personalities of kaspersky what is eugene kaspersky the ceo co founder ceo founder of the kaspersky lab like very beginning i said uh, mr eugene kaspersky along with natalia kaspersky they they formed this company eugene was uh, his msc in maths if i am not wrong and uh, he was working in a company and on the research side and suddenly he found uh, curious to know about viruses and he started writing antivirus tools that's how avp tools had come antivirus pro tools and then suddenly they realized they can do business out of it that's how the kaspersky brown is born and the technical side is the techy guy is the mastermind he when it comes to cyber security he is an authority worldwide but when it when i look at his personality his personality is fantastic you will not find him wearing a suit much more any time and unless it is a very special occasion where he has to go and meet a president of a country or prime minister of country which he does quite often in whichever country he visits absolutely carefree person and very flamboyant very 
I call in India we call it as Bindas. Bindas means absolutely no hassles. He is running a nearly a billion dollar company, but then he doesn't have that uh, ego or that kind of a thing. I am a billion dollar company and I am the one of the most. In fact, uh, if, is going if I the uh, uh, is the larger Kaspersky Lab is the la largest privately owned software vendor and at the same time is growing very fast. He doesn't have that kind of things and he doesn't have that he is the most successful uh, entrepreneurs of Russia. If top one, two, three is counted then using Kaspersky name has to come. And his aura is such that I will give you a simple my personal example that uh, when I joined Kaspersky lab about two and a half years back I was to go to Moscow and suddenly I got a mail and I have to go to my headquarters then I have to take a visa India uh, Indians have to have Moscow visa when I reached to the visa center in Bombay uh, they have closed they, they close at 1 30 I reached there by about 2 o'clock then the guard said that sir it's over now you have to come only tomorrow I said no I have to go by tomorrow evening so it will be difficult can you send uh, okay just I gave my gave my card just give it to your visa officer. He went and showed the visa officer my card, Kaspersky lab card. Then visa officer called and he started speaking with me in Russia. Then I said, no, no, I don't know Russian. Then he said, no, 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 Eugene Kaspersky is very big man for us and you are from his company. So within 15 minutes, I got my visa done up without anything. So that's the kind of a power he wields. That's the kind of influence he wields. If you go to the Facebook site, Eugene Kaspersky, you see the number of likes. His likes are, I think, more than Sachin Tendulkar. The likes what Sachin Tendulkar got, using Kaspersky has got much more than that, I suppose. Definitely try and I want to bring use to all the countries which I represent and Bangladesh is on the top priority. So, Yuzin likes Bangladesh. So, we will try to bring him and to, to bring use to this country, like I said, there is two personalities I wanted to talk about. The second personality will be more uh, influential. That is uh, my Asia Pacific uh, Managing Director, Mr. Harry Chung. Mr. Harry Chung is also a very interesting personality. Very seasoned businessman. He has been rated as a top 10 business persons of the year in China. And he's been, uh, he has got uh, various businesses in which Kaspersky, he heads Kaspersky Lab Asia Pacific for about uh, nearly about 30 35 countries, and he is a person with a very big vision. He also started his career in a very humble manner, reached to such an heights just because of his sheer determination. And uh, he is a good mentor. The reason I said uh, I will mention him is that I consider him as one of my mentors for this uh, product and this industry and he has got terrific knowledge about the how to put softwares and uh, how to do security software business he knows various kinds of business models and he, he has come to bangladesh he has come to bangladesh mm -hmm. so that's mr harry chung and he is uh, not only a technical person not only an entrepreneur he is also a good philanthropist he is also a good uh, singer, he can dance, he can do anything on this earth. So, <laughs> he has got a black belt. <laughs> so, he is a versatile person, personality. So, both these guys, Eugene and uh, Harry, they make a deadly team. So, that is uh, that is about Harry both of us. Mm. So, Harry will be, I will be putting pressure on Harry to get using into this country and inshallah we shall have use in within a year I suppose. The reason for me to be here is one uh, I haven't met my resellers okay distributors so will be keep meeting but uh, I haven't met my resellers for quite some time so we want to keep our close touch with our reselling partners and uh, also we are launching a product called Kaspersky Small Office Security which is for up to 25 uh, computers office which doesn't have an enterprise server or anything just a file server who doesn't have a 
proper uh, EDP department or computer department or un proper know how about 5, 10 users, 15 users, 20 users or 25 users. For them this product is going to be a boon instead of having one one uh, security so one one internet security software on each computer. It is a centrally managed uh, security software with uh, all the features of enterprise product but not having so much of sophistication or so much of technical knowledge you need is simple just install it forget it renew it next year and uh, you, you know the offices where they don't require big computer specialist to be there a small guy who, know, who understands how microsoft how to start a computer can install this ksos and then uh, the local support from the office extracts will pay way for this product a buy and uh, khuda office i will like to tell you guys ki use security software and if it is kaspersky nothing like it thank you very much